Hey, this is Doug from Doug and Nikki, and we are outside here in the Doug and Nikki Technology Studio, which is a little warm today in Florida. But today we're gonna do a very, very cool unboxing setup and review of the Holystone HS440 drone. So what I'm gonna do in this video is I'm gonna unbox it, I'm gonna charge it up, we're gonna take it out, we're gonna fly it, then I'm gonna come back and give you a review with a Doug score from one to five and let you know how much I like or maybe I don't like this particular drone. But that's what we're gonna do today. So what do you say we start by unboxing it, reviewing what comes with, we'll kind of talk about some of the features while we are doing that. Let's get in here and take a look at it. I'm very excited. This drone is a entry level drone with a very competitive starting point in terms of the cost. Let's take a look and see what it, oh, it comes with a case. I did not even realize it came with a case. Oh, look at that. That is a really nice case. So this is a 2.4 gigahertz drone with a 1080p camera. Oh, look at how cool this thing is. This thing is so small, it's 166 grams. So you are below the weight that requires to, that you register with the FAA, which is nice. You can fly it anywhere. You don't have to start messing with that stuff. Comes with two batteries. These are the batteries. They each give you a flight time of about 20 minutes. So between the two, you could have 40 minutes of flight time uh, right out of the box with everything it comes with. Here are those two batteries. How cool is that? So it comes with, here's the controller. With the controller, you have a button for the take a picture. If you hold it down, it starts the camera. This is the head control mode. If you put this on, the drone won't change its orientation. It will stay fixed in that orientation as you move around. It has a low or a high speed. So you also need to know that this button here, if you press it once, you do, it's a high speed rotation. The drone just like does a complete 360. If you press it and hold it for a longer period of time, it'll give you a beep and then it'll do like a long sweeping uh, circle, which is a really cool function. So as I was saying, this camera is only a single access gimbal. So the video, unless you're not moving around, could be a little, Little, little motion inducing there, but um, the photos should be great. As long as you're steady and careful about what you're doing in terms of video, the video should be fine at a 1080p. It's nice that it does gimbal so that you can move it so maybe you can uh, take the blades out of the image if that's what you want. So it comes with a screwdriver so you can change the blades if you needed to. Comes with four extra blades. Um, these are the chargers, the USB chargers for the batteries. I just cannot believe how small and light that is. I think that is so super cool. Let's put it down here. Obviously it comes with an instruction manual, which is key, especially if you're new to drones, you need to read this carefully, make sure you understand what you're doing. It's gonna teach you how to operate it. It's also gonna tell you how to download the app. Here are the codes to download the app, which I will be doing. And yeah, so those are the basics of what you need to know. What do you say we charge it up, put it up in the air and see how it works? While we're flying around, let's talk about some of the cool features that it does come with. It does come with that 1080p camera, which we discussed, which at this price point, I think the camera was like outstanding for what it is. It has a gravity sensor, so it's fairly easy to fly. It's FPV, so you can see where you're flying as you fly. And I will say I downloaded the app and the app worked perfectly very first shot, which was a big thumbs up for me. It has gesture control, it has tap fly, and obviously 40 minutes of fly time is a long time with the two batteries that come with it. I was thrilled with this. I have to give this a strong five out of five on the Doug score or four rotors out of four rotors. We'll see you next time.